So when you look at this website, you think, wow, it's really put together. Just because a website is put together, it does not make it legit, honey. It does not make it legit. Any logical person would be like, if you know hair, if you know about buying hair, about selling hair, if you know hair, any logical person would be like, Fadzai, there is no way you're buying hair for $17. It does not make sense. There is no way. Tell me, baby, why you look like that? Walk like that, talk like that. You move it different, so you push me back. And you pull me back, but you hurt me back, yeah. I just wanna be your baby. We ain't even gotta do nothing crazy. So, in this video, I'm gonna be talking about how I got scammed. I'm gonna walk you guys through this website and I'm gonna show you the stuff I got and you're gonna see this is a fucking scam. One day I was just laying in bed, scrolling through Instagram and I saw an ad for my hair. That's what the hair company is called. And I'm gonna say the name because it is a scam and people should know the name. I looked at it and they were doing this offer. They're still doing this offer. Buy two, get one free and free shipping over $45. So I was like, it's not it's not every day you see a hair company doing buy two get one free so i was like okay let me just look into it i looked at it and i was like like i walked into it knowing that i could there's a high high potential of me getting scammed and i guess i accepted that risk so i went onto the website and I'm gonna have the website up here for you guys. And I saw the prices were not even a hundred. It had the prices were like a hundred and twenty something striped out, meaning they're on sale. For now, 17 quid, 26 quid, 30 quid, and you're thinking raw. But I thought they must have a high demand. Because when you have a high demand in something, you can afford to sell something at a lower price because you know the demand is always going to be there. People have a high demand for hair, regardless whether it's Brazilian, Indian, Peruvian, whatever the case is, people have a high demand for hair. This is me just trying to, trying to give it a chance because I was so broke. I was like, I don't want to spend 80 quid on hair. Let me find a good hair, please. I was just trying to convince myself like, yeah, you're, you're broke right now, but it's okay. You, like, we're going to get you some good ass hair. Like, you'll be good, sis. You'll be good. Let's go. I was trying to convince myself. This is how I'm trying to convince myself. And in my head, I'm still like, no, 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 no. Like, no. But guys hair is an investment <laughs> it really is the price you pay is for the quality you receive if you pay a low price for hair the quality is not going to be great that that's just it's it's black and white with hair like it is what it is so all in all the total cost came up to be 112 dollars 25 so i saved 44 pounds 65 so it was around 80 to 90 pounds in conversion and I thought, 80 to 90 pounds, that's a good price for that much hair. Uh, for six like six types of hair, normally you can buy one hair for that price. So I was like, that's a good price. But keep in mind, I kind of suspected that it was too good to be true. Like, you just have to live life knowing that some things are just too good to be true. Um, so I could not find any reviews about this company. And when I did, I went on YouTube and I realized that I had been trading under different names and that's how they had no good or bad reviews. So they trade under Aim Ray Shop and Love Hair 2 and they trade under um, My Good and they trade under My Hair which I bought off the My Hair website and all their websites, I'm going to put them up here just to show you guys how different they are. That's why I could not find anything about these people, good or bad. I think the Emery shop has been shut down because I remember I looked it up one time and it was coming up, but now it's not. It's a good thing I paid with PayPal, guys. If you are not sure about a certain company but you want to chance it anyway, always pay with PayPal. So when I found that out, I emailed them like two or three emails saying, yo, can I get a refund? I wasn't nice about it because I knew it was a scam. So I was like, yo, can I get, it wasn't even a proper email. It was like sending a text message. I was like, can I get a refund? They took time to reply. But when they did, they were like, you're gonna have to wait for your items to come. When they come, that's when you can do your refund, blah, 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 this shit, whatever. So when my hair did come, I emailed them again. And then they sent me the stuff about the refund. I, I read it 
and I just ignored it because at that time I had opened a case with PayPal and PayPal granted my case but I missed the deadline so I didn't end up getting my money back. That was my fault. I should have got my money back. I just didn't end up pursuing the case because obviously PayPal couldn't do it because it was after the refund policy or whatever and I didn't bother contacting the website for my refund just because I thought it would cost me more just to even return all that stuff and I wouldn't even get my full money back because if you think about the shipping to return your stuff. So you kind of look at it and you're like, wow, buy two, get one free, bargain queen, like let's go. See the pictures, I'm like, wow, these people look good. It's good, let's go. Like I, I still know that I'm taking a risk, but I'm like, let's go. And you're gonna see this is a fucking scam, a fuckery. It comes in numbers. So this is how this one comes. This one I think is a 360 lace frontal wigs, Brazilian straight human hair, wigs for a black woman, 100% virgin hair. So this hair was $119 and it's now on sale for $18.68. When I bought it, it was $36.68. This is madness. So this... <sighs> Guys. No human hair is shiny. It's shiny. Like, okay, this is meant to be 24 inches. 24 inches. Okay, the inches could be right. There is shedding. Like, you guys can't even see. Shiny. Like, shiny hair is synthetic hair. Like, I know because back in the days, I used to put baby powder on my synthetic hair so it wouldn't be shiny. Like, no one wants to be a grease ball. Like, no one wants... Sh like, it just does not look natural. It does not look natural. You know what I mean? This is not even the worst part. It gets worse. It gets worse. <laughs> this is meant to be a 360 lace. 300 okay so for people who don't know hair who are watching this video like what are you talking about this is plastic this is plastic when you have a 360 this is the um what's this thing called you should it should be the same color as your scalp this is plastic and this is white 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 a lace frontal is meant to go around the whole thing especially if it's 360 which it does not do. It's just a, a weave cap, basically. Just a weave cap. And look, what is this? What? This gets worse. This gets worse. Why is my hair cut? Like, what? These aren't even baby hairs. What is this? I have a big head, and I really don't even think that I could fit on my head like that. So, it does, like, okay, this, if you didn't care about your wigs, like how they looked, as long as you had something over this would be perfect like this would be perfect as long as you cover the frontal you could get a bandana and like rock it just have some baby powder just to get rid of the shine and like it should be calm i'm just gonna show you guys the length this is what it comes to you i don't know guys what would you rate this out of <laughs> out of 10 10 being amazing what would you rate this i'm telling you just hide the top wear a hat baby powder you're good you're good you're good sis but yeah this this ain't it this one breaks my heart and i'm gonna tell you why this breaks my heart these people sent me the same wig they sent me the same bloody wig because they're numbered 658 658 i know what you're probably thinking fat like in what world would you get this color please Please relax. One of these is meant to be a 360 lace wig pre pluck body wave with baby hair, brown mixed gold. When I put the picture up, you're going to be like, What the hell? It is not the same thing. And the other one is 140% as in the density, like the thickness, human hair wave, straight wigs, brown color. This is literally the same hair. Regardless of which is which, it's the same hair, so it's not gonna make a difference. I am disgusted. I'm just, I, I'm just disgusted. I can't. You know when you just don't know what to do with your life? Like, you just don't know what to say? 
what to do like so this is the length again it's, it's meant to be 360 well one of them is again it's not it's, this is just plastic this part is just plastic straight away it's synthetic hair the shine gives it off and like okay let's like this is so naughty look if I break my nail the shedding isn't a lot okay now it's a lot that's a lot let's put this on and see my head is too big this does not fit my head guys this is really not it this one cannot be saved listen if you look good and blonde rock this do your thing like rock it baby rock it let's just try the bandana let's do a length check obviously one side's gonna be longer than the other because it's not on properly i'm not fooling anyone like we're not doing this <laughs> but this is hair number two watch my curls Ooh, ooh. i'm trying to hide the black i want the high, black hide. it's a whole new bitch like i'm not even fat side anymore like who am i who am i because honey pose Yeah, okay. Whoa. The Brazilian Natural Sexy Raw Human Hair. And that was $25. $25.77. And then the blonde one, one of the blondes one, I got them for free. And the other one I paid £26 for. $26. Again, you can see the shine. This one's not like the blonde ones. It doesn't get caught. Shedding's not that much, actually. Same, these are all the same situation inside, I'm presuming. It's synthetic. Fake shit, fake shit, fake shit. The length check. This shininess is not for me. I really like jet black hair. Like that's what I was saying. Like I love the jet blackness because I really like black hair, like jet black hair. Let's do a brush test because what the hell? Can you hear that? I don't know. No one deserves to hear it when you're brushing your hair. You know what I'm thinking? What goes on in these people's heads when this is what they're advertising and this is not what they're selling? Like, do they, do they actually believe they're selling good quality? So we have two more hairs left. So this is the bob. The bob was free. Bob was one of the free items. Now this is just going to look jacked up because... One, the others could not fit on my head, so I don't know how this one plans on doing so. This makes me so insecure because my head is so big that I can't even put on a wig. Like, why? <laughs> when you look from the side, it's like, hold up. Next one. This is our last one. At least they got the curl texture on this one right. This one is the Deep Wave Wig Swiss Lace Brazilian Human Hair, which was $23.80. And it's shiny at the top, same situation inside. I like, I don't know, I like how it's bouncy, it's full. I like that, I like that. Like, don't talk to me. When I'm wearing this hair, do not talk to me. I'm not going to be wearing this hair again. to you if I was to pick a favorite out of all those shambolic six it's this one like okay when I brushed it it's like what like come on look at all of this that I'm like what it's not it's not good this hair is not good I'm trying to brush it ah! this is yeah no okay okay if you want hair Shout me, hit me up, I'll gladly donate all of this to you because I don't know what the hell I'm going to do with it. So in conclusion, in my review, this hair is not good. It does not even have a 360 lace. It does not even have lace. It's just plastic. It's shiny as fuck. Like, maintaining this hair would cost you more than actually buying a good, decent price of hair. And that is basically how I got scammed and my experience and am I gonna do it again? Most likely. Because that was just really dumb. I can't lie. Ew, yeah.
but I knew what I was getting myself into like I went in with the heart knowing that it's either gonna be actually better than expected or it's either gonna be shit so let me know which one out of the six is your favorite um let me know if you're gonna buy from this website but yeah so I hope you guys liked this video if you did give it a thumbs up comment down below if you have any other future videos you want me to do and subscribe to my channel thank you so much guys for watching bye